Mr. Tim Jones was supposed to be delivering money from the French government to the Indonesian government. He took this bus and is seen getting on, but at the other end, he was not on the bus when they came to collect him. This meant that the money was not received. And、uh, what happened to Tim Jones? Well, we do have a theory. Have you heard of Monsieur Leopold, sir? Yes, I have. Well, the car of his sidekick was seen at nine fifty-one local time, perhaps carrying Tim Jones's dead body. Leopold's sidekick is a very clever man, but he always changes his name, so we have no photograph of him. However, our experts have drawn a mathematically constructed picture of him. He is identified through his scar on one cheek and an oddly shaped ear, as well as widely recognized for his whiskers. So he is the man who intercepted the money handover. Monsieur Leopold is very rich and very clever. He owns two major skyscrapers. This is where he masterminds all of his plans. This may be where the sidekick brought Tim Jones's dead body, as well as the money. What of Leopold? He is sixty-two, has seventeen wives, his company earns eight billion pounds a year, and his properties across the world cost five hundred billion. And what's this? A coded message he sent to the president of Indonesia. Our experts have decoded the message, and it proves that the president was being blackmailed.